around November 2004 when I started. And I'll never forget, the first time I came in, I came in with my brother and a buddy of mine, Jake, who kind of sporadically trains still. And uh, came in, there's no desk lady or anything, walk into it, everybody's got their bad boy shorts on, no shirts, everybody's, I don't know if they're juiced to the gills or not, but they look like it. Just a bunch of big intimidating guys, and I think I was 19 at the time and nobody came up, said anything. I grabbed a flyer with an email address on it, walked out, sent an email, and that's how I started jujitsu. The reason why I was out searching is actually we had, long story short, somebody very close to the family did something very bad and got put away, and I knew I needed to be able to defend myself for whenever that person got out. My first year in college, which was uh, 2005, I ended up doing OCS for the Marines, and I had sought out doing jujitsu so that I would have something for hand-to-hand -hand combat. And that is why I started jujitsu and that is why I've stuck with jujitsu. Sport aspect is great, but like I'm always preaching to these guys, it always comes down to the self-defense portion of it. It's a huge release for me. It's the only place where I feel like I can get out as much aggression as I need to out on the mats and they're still gonna be your friends afterwards. Like if I didn't have jujitsu to keep me level, who knows? what I would be doing. Anthony, he has half a lung, why are you dogging it? Don't be a bitch, Dickie, finish that. Finish that triangle, Alec, break that grip, right on his grip, right on his grip. He pushes you beyond what you think you can do, just enough, so that you feel like crap, and you don't think you're gonna make it, but when you do make it, you take that next step. Stop where you are, squat thrust, go! My real goal eventually is to produce a jiu-jitsu world champion. I, I love teaching, I think that the style of jiu-jitsu that I have for be it submission only spin, or point on is, um, spin, 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 spin. I think I have the ability to make world champion. So I would like to one day be able to do that. So that is my goal for teaching in Jiu Jitsu right now. You make sure you own that arm bar. How are you gonna let the super heavyweight beat you? That's better. If you wanna compete, he's the guy to see. I mean, I can give you the stereotypical answer. I love seeing people grow, blah, blah, blah. But you know, it's, it's just fun to teach. It's fun to pass on knowledge. I mean, to be able to take somebody who comes in, who can't defend themselves at all, doesn't even know how to move, and then see them progress over the years into like eventually mat killers, and you know that if anyone were to mess with them on the street, they have no idea what they just got themselves into. They're gonna demonstrate some techniques. So technique number one, we're gonna do a regular hip throw. Black belt used to mean something to me. Um, now that I've been in the sport for so long, I actually kinda wish we'd get away from belts. I think it, um, it's really starting to taint the system a little bit. You don't have belts in wrestling and people know how good people are in wrestling and where they should compete and everything like that. I think we're, we should start to get away from it in jujitsu because you get into weird pecking orders at gyms. It, it actually develops bad egos because of belts and things like that. So I kind of knew Ben was going to be serious right off the bat because I think it was your first class, right? Is the person still here? That did, Was it Frank? Steve. <laughs> What'd you do to it? <laughs> My knee got stuck, kneecap got stuck in the mats and it shifted out yeah so it, i couldn't roll for my first three months yeah so he put those bats that hit like that and and he butt listen the very next day he was back there watching and i was like oh this guy's really gonna stick through it and he has he's been through all kinds of changes he even um did tournaments is an awesome instructor even had a brief mma career under an alias name <laughs> undefeated. Yeah. undefeated and today he's getting his black belt So yeah, it'll be a nice beat down of an hour and a half of guys just trying to murder me and me trying to survive and then we'll all go grab food afterwards, so it'll be great. Hey guys, uh, you know I appreciate all the support. All you guys are like family. I do whatever I could do for you guys and a lot of you guys will echo the same thing. So it's always great training here. Um, just stick with it. I see a lot of you pop in and out after months at a time. It's kind of depressing for me when you guys do that. So stick with jujitsu, and I'll see everybody here tomorrow for comp class. Do the lap. Yeah. <laughs>